It's Matt and Mike on the mic with the first Slapper Cap reaction review. And we're doing this little Uzi Vert P2. We just listened to the whole track. And instead of listening to the track and pausing and stopping and y'all getting it, you know, we want to give you the whole thing at one time. Ain't that the same? Yeah. You're the one to blame. Yeah. Try to keep it real with you, but you're the one that changed. How I mean, you won't change? Taking different way it came. Murder was the case, and now it blew out the brain. Out the brain. See me now, yeah. switching through different lines. Yeah. Smoking on different strains. Yeah. I got money on my brain. We are not the same. I put them on the chain. So we just listened to the song. It's the first one we li listened to off of the uh, Eternal. Eternal Attack. I call it eternal attacking, attacking mushroom, but you know, eternal attack album that he just dropped. When he dropped that, well, this song was like within the last five days, so last week or so, like that. I didn't even hear nothing about him dropping an album before this, so kind of like I mean, I don't listen to him like that. You know, I like a couple songs from him, so. Right. Trying to see what he really got, like go into his album and see what it's all about instead of just listening to the bigger hits. Right now, for this one right here, first thing I'm gonna say is I like the beat. The beat is hard, yeah. The beat, uh, the, beat the beat is definitely raw. It's uh, they flipped it up a whole different way that I definitely wasn't expecting. Um, the whole song was definitely not expected when I seen the P2. You know, I, I don't know what P2 means now, I know, but so P2 means part two. Part two. And it's the part two to XO2 of life. life. Right. Um, it's definitely a dope remix. It's technically not a remix, though. He switched the words up, so. It's kind of like a remake or a cover. Yeah. He, de he definitely flipped it up. It's not the same song. I know a lot of people are either mad about that or, should I say, disappointed. Mm -hmm. But the shit sound good. Like, really good. He flipped it. We've talked about doing stuff like that. Taking a song that you already done and like evolving it to make it better. So he definitely flipped it and I think he made it better. So if you listen to the track and you think he made it better, let us know. Was it worse, better, or she just like left it alone? And people so used to just hearing the XO tour like the way it is. Right. I done forgot about the song, so hearing this was a good refresh. Um who made the beat? I want to know who made the beat because I think that the production itself made the song. Let us know in the comments. And maybe he was the first person who made the EXO Tour Life. It might be. To, to, to redo it. Um, y'all think it was, like I say, y'all think it was better, worse, what? Do y'all like the song in general, period? As far as the album, I heard some people say that it was the, this is the best song off the album, period. A line that he said that was crazy, he said, my life is like a day, I'm just living, my life is like a long day, I'm just living in the moment. Damn. And, uh, that I, was dope. Yeah, it was dope. And I, I definitely like the first verse better than the second verse. I feel like the second verse kind of, like, was just a filler. You know what I mean? I, but he did try to, like, bounce the same rhyme and words and keep the same parts as far as the melody and everything. I, I, yeah, I, I did love how he was just staying, he was staying in that pocket, and he was killing it at the same time. The Lil Uzi, for this one right now, on the Matt and Mike meter, I'm gonna give it a 10. I'm gonna give it a 10 as well. Just because I've never heard nobody, other than, uh, the only, the closest thing that I can think of right now to something like this was the song that Luke, uh, Jordan Lucas did, where he rapped the whole song forward, and then he rapped the same words Backwards, right. That's like this type of a pocket and round that we're gonna put this in. Right. It's the only thing close to that right now. So I think he definitely creatively he went out of the box. And I, I love hearing music like that. Love it. Love it. Love it. And it's been a minute, it's been a minute, it's been a time coming, so we will get in the rest of this eternal itaki. Eternal take. Oh, <laughs> my bad. And then you know, other shit going down right now, you know. So we got the lights all on deck, hand sanitizer. We got no fucking toilet paper though. Your motherfuckers bought it all off the shelf. Where is that? Where is it at though? Matt and Mike on the mic. The first slap of cap, cap reaction review. Hey.